esticadas, inchada no ombro e nada vim, nada enfim Recria sozinho, com a alma cheia de mágoa e as panelas vazias Sonho imundo, só água na geladeira e eu querendo salvar o mundo No fundo é tipo David Blaine, a mãe assume, o pai some de costume No máximo é um sobrenome, sou terror dos clones Esses boy conhece Marx, nós conhece a fome Então cerra os punhos, sorria e jamais volte pra sua quebrada de mão Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the Premier League. It's Swansea City against Burnley. So without more ado, let's head off to the Liberty Stadium, the home of Swansea City, where I'm pleased to say it is a glorious, clear day. Your commentary team is Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Well, we've got Barclays Premier League action for you. I'm Martin Tyler and with me is Alan Smith. Yeah, Martin, great to be here. Swansea hoping that they can reach the same heights again as they did in their away win against Manchester United. Yeah, surprisingly so, 4-1. But uh, they're full of it at the moment. I think they might get themselves another win here. This is Swansea City's team for you today. Lucas Fabianski plays in goal. Ashley Williams plays with Jordi Amat in central defence. Leon Britton plays with John Joe Shelby in the centre of the park. In attack, Patrick Timbi Gomi starts. He scored a hat trick in the last game. This is the Burnley lineup. Tom Heaton starts in goal. Nader Manua has starts with Jason Shackle as the centre backs. George Boyd starts with Scott Arfield in the wide positions. Ashley Barnes is the main striker today. Back in front of their own fans, they'll be hopeful to get off to a good start because we are looking for me at a mid table sort of side mid-ranking nothing better than that and probably nothing worse than that either up against the team that gave us all a lot of excitement last year in gaining promotion it will be uh, fascinating to see them cope with this challenge away from home we might learn a bit more about them come the end of this match Rafik Timbi Gomis well only two games into the season Alan he's got three goals already well the perfect start just what you're after as a striker the referee Kevin Friend and Burnley were up and down again a couple of years back. I don't know whether we thought we'd see them again in the Premier League, but uh, they've done so well to be promoted in 2014. Well, haven't they just, Martin, in the league, the championship, which is so hard to get out of, and full marks to all the players concerned. George Boyd. And hits it. Just too high. Kieran Trippier. It's war. Can he turn away from the challenge here? Nathan Dyer. Gomez. Slipped his man. Brilliant opening. Here's the chance. And that is the first goal. And it could be the one that actually shapes the destiny of the day. The goal from Gomez. And there was a gap to the keeper's left. this goal
nele. Delgado. Referees officiating properly here within the laws of the game. Quite entitled to give that as a free kick. Although early, sometimes the players expect to get away with it, I think. Fairly won the ball cleanly, and as we thought, Burnley are going to make a change. Well, we've got an injured player now, and the referee has called a halt. While the injured player has gone off, we're going to get the game restarted with a drop ball. For the manager, instant impact. That's often the case, of course, but now it's the second competitive game. In with a chance! And the goalkeeper able to deal with that quite comfortably. Britain. Not to be. And the goalkeeper very much on his game today. With this goal advantage, they've now got a corner. Nothing wrong with the shot, really, except the direction it was hit well enough. The goalkeeper didn't have to move a muscle except to catch it. John Joe Shelby. And for Tim B. Gomez. Came in with the challenge and the ball broke free. Close range shots, got to be. Well, it's a goal, it's a terrific goal for the new signing. And we knew he was talented, we knew he was excited, and we have to show that with the first opportunity here. Side of the goal. Good look here again by the replay of the goal. Shelby. Oh, he's through. Here's the chance. Still in play here. And he goes for goal. Well, there was a great chance to add to their lead. Well, you just wonder whether they're taking it easy. And you wonder whether they'll live to do that mistake. Could the opposition come back at them now? the attack here could be a yellow card here for that foul well here is the goal Jefferson Montero's goal yeah that's a nice finish that is on the right hand side of the goal I think he saw the gap there Gilfie Sigurdsson. Well, he's hit that from some distance. How well has he hit it? Brilliant goal. Distance, I cannot believe it. 
Let's see the replay now. Great tackle. Gomez. Well, the ball has gone up to show five minutes of added time. Off the crossbar. And back into the penalty area. Now for Timbe Gomez. to the keeper there with power, with accuracy, from distance, wonderful. Coming up another look at it, Alan, that will show us something. A wonderful advantage at this stage. They lead by four goals to nil. Good challenge here. Half time here, and who would believe this scoreline? Some excellent play here, yeah, and they've got full reward for the good football. And sometimes you don't do your Martin, but uh, they have here. They've had an end product at the end of some good passing moves. Well, one way traffic in that first half. It looks all done and dusted. I just can't see that big lead being lost. Let's take a look at the highlights from that first half, and then we'll get straight back to the commentators for the rest of the contest. to see that's a brilliant goal Scoring this game as we start the second half speaks volumes about the strength of one team and the lack of strength of the other. That'll be the goalkeeper's ball. Delgado, that was an easy decision for the assistant. It's offside. He's gone too early. Yeah, you do have to take a chance when you play that kind of game, but they're confident in the way that they're regimented at the back.
Burnley bench. There is movement afoot. Long range effort and a fine effort too. We've got a substitution coming up, Alan, now, and it's, it's the midfield player who's going off. And in that part of the pitch, they've been second best. They have been. His teammates haven't helped, but he looked low on confidence, really. Um, couldn't get into the game, and it's a, it's a sensible decision by the manager. Gilfie Sigurdsson. Tackling technique to win the ball cleanly. Cross coming in now. That's a nice challenge. And the ref do. Now, well, what about Swansea City in their next game? Yeah, they're playing West Bromwich Albion in the next match in the Barclays Premier League, and I think they could coast home in this one. Going to get a substitution here from Burnley. And that uh, the flag is up, it has gone out off the play. Well, here was a chance for him to make a real impression in the wide areas, um, but he's being substituted now. And I think the crowd, by the sound of it, quite happy to see the back of him. Yeah, well, I don't think his fullback will be because he had him in his pocket, but. No end product from this lad today. Poor day for him. To Jones. down at the Swansea bench, there's going to be a substitute brought on. George Boyd. And that will be a throw. It's only two, I say only two, it's a great effort, isn't it? But his uh, eyes narrowed a bit when he saw his number going up there and the chance of a hat-trick is not going to be there. No, not today, but uh, maybe next week if he carries on playing like that. Amak. This is going to be a throw. John Joe Shelby. Takes the shot off. It's a goal. The keeper's got no chance because he's hit it so he's right I'll have another look at this goal
box seat now after that goal. To Jones. Well, he's lent the ball to his mates. He's got it back again. That's very well read, and that's a very good interception. We could be in. And hits it, dives away the keeper to keep it out. And here we'll see what they can manage from the corner. And he goes for goal. Oh, the shot was blocked. Close. They've still got an opportunity here after the goalkeeper parried it. It's gone out for a throw in. Delgado. was a foul, but Burnley can play on, they've still got the ball, the advantage applies. We'll encourage one or two players, still five minutes to go, of added time. Good, strong challenge. Here's the shot. That is a fantastic goal. Sighted, but he's just beaten by the power of this shot to his right. It's a beauty. A good look here again by the replay of the goal. in the game now but it's been put to bed really with the widening of the margin on the scoreline Here he and here's the shot Black, the old one two so quick one after the other Look at the net pulled in there because he has blasted that hole from outside the box. Let's have another peek at that goal. Team on top form, the other team in no form at all. Delgado. In the 90th minute, number seven, Neil Britton. That's a great effort by the winners here as the final whistle goes and they can celebrate a win After with game, plenty of goals. Will find their bus right where you, left it. you don't often get such a one sided match at this level of the game, but that's what we've seen, Alan. Well, we have, and uh, credit to the players out there for playing so well and for dominating it right from start to finish. Well, there was really only one team in that game and their fans will be travelling home delighted with their big victory. I'll leave you with the full match highlights and until next time, I've been Jeff Stelling. Bye for now.
that's a brilliant goal. Well taken.